Unit 2. Connecting to Nature What do you think connecting to nature means? Well, let's look at the photo and read the caption. The photo shows cheetahs. It also shows a jeep, people riding in the jeep, and I see in the background mountains and fields. I also see a cloudy sky. The caption says cheetahs taking a ride on a jeep, on safari in Africa. Well, these are cheetahs, a kind of cat. This is a jeep, and these people are on safari. We will learn more about what safari means as we get into this unit. For part one of this unit, we will be listening. Recognize a speaker's tone and feeling. We will be speaking using descriptive language. And we will be using pronunciation, talking about thought groups and pausing. We will learn more about these things as we go through this unit. Let's turn to the next page. We are not in class, so we cannot have a discussion. But let's look at each of these items, one, two, and three. Look at the map. Where is the Serengeti National Park? Well. Here's the map. This is the country of Africa. Within this box is the Serengeti National Park. Where is the Sahar Serengeti National Park? It is located in Africa. But where in Africa? If we draw a line from the top to the bottom of Africa <clears throat> and a line from the left side to the right side of Africa, we would have four parts. A part here, a part here, a part here, and a part here. This part is called the southeast. This is northwest. This is southwest. This is northeast. And this is southeast. So, the Serengeti National Park is in southeast Africa. Number two, describe the photo. What is happening? How does it make you feel? Well, let me describe the photo and you listen and stop the video after I have described the video and you describe the video yourself. I should say, describe the picture. Here's the photo or picture. I see a cheetah, and it is chasing another animal. This animal that looks a little bit like a cow is called a wildebeest. Wildebeest. So, a cheetah is chasing a wildebeest. In the background are many wildebeests, and it looks like they are in a field. 
That is my description of this photo. Now stop the video and you describe the photo yourself. Now let's look at number three. What is a safari? Share what you know about this experience. Well, I have never been on a safari. I think a safari is an adventure or a trip that people take out in the wilderness. <clears throat> I have only been to the mountains, but I have never been to Africa or a very large desert. So I have never been on a safari. How about you? Stop the video and try to explain what is a safari, if you know. Now, let's move on. 1.9. Think critically. Predict. Predict means tell what you think will happen. You are going to hear a conversation between a man and a woman at work. The man has just returned from a safari in the Serengeti National Park. Listen to the first part of the conversation, then answer these questions. Let's listen. Unit 2, Part 1, Page 24, Exercise B, Predict. Hey Tom, welcome back. How was your vacation? It was awesome. Oh yeah? Where did you go? I went to the Serengeti National Park. I spent 10 days on a photo safari. Wow! What made you decide to do that? Well, there were a couple of reasons. Now, for numbers 1, 2, and 3, Let's answer these questions. Number one, what kind of safari did the man go on? Number two, how does the man describe his experience? And number three, what will the man probably talk about next? Listen again to the man's discussion with the woman. And then answer one, two, and three. Type your answers and submit them as homework. Be sure to write sentences as good as you can. Good luck. <laughs>